Guys, it's Hank here, and I've been requested to make a video on how to create a virtual machine up. Um, a lot of you like my technical support scam videos, and there's a lot of people wondering how I do it and want to know how I create a virtual machine up. So, uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a virtual machine up very fast and very easily. And what I use is something called VMware Workstation. Um, you can get it by doing a Google search for uh, VMware Workstation. And um, here's their website here. You can download yourself a free trial and uh, install it to your computer. All right, so once you installed the uh, VMware Workstation to your computer, you're going to need either need a Windows CD. And if you don't have a Windows CD, I have put together some ISO files so you can install whatever version of Windows you want. So I'll leave the link in the description box. So what you guys have to do is you have to download one of these ISO files. And uh, once you have these ISO files downloaded and you have VMware Workstation installed to your computer, I'll show you how to create a virtual machine up. All right, so go ahead and open up VMware Workstation. And um, when you open this up, you're gonna the first thing you want to do is you want to click File, and then you want to come down to where it says Create New Virtual Machine. All right, so once that opens up, you're gonna see. Uh, a window here called typical recommended and you're going to have that checked you'll click next and in here you're going to see where it says installer disk image ISO and uh, you're going to check that then you're going to click browse and uh, you're going to browse to whatever ISO file that you downloaded so in my case I'm going to install Windows 8.1 and uh, once you have that checked you're going to go click next and then you can select a username for the account and uh, you can enter a product key here if you have one, but I don't right now, so uh, I'll enter that in during the installation. So then you're going to click Next. And then here you'll name the virtual machine. Um, I'm going to just name it Windows 8.1. And uh, once you do that, you're just going to click Next. And uh, it will automatically create yourself you guys a uh, 60 gigabyte partition now you can change this if you want the hard drive on the virtual machine to be bigger but keep in mind whatever space you have on your C drive that is going to be uh, taken off your C drive so uh, whatever space you have available on your C drive that will be taken off of the C drive and used as a partition so you can install the virtual OS alright so I'm going to just leave it at 60 gigabytes you guys can change that if you want so click next And once that's done, you're just going to click finished. And that's going to go ahead and create a desk up for us. So uh, we'll let that load, and uh, when that's done, we'll get ready to install the virtual machine. Okay, so once that's done, it will go ahead and that will power on the virtual machine for us. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and turn off the virtual machine real quick. Um, once you created this up, you'll see the Windows 8.1 is listed here. Um, what you can do is you can click, uh, click, you can click on it, and you can. Uh, what you want to do is you want to click where it says memory, and um, you can adjust this so if you want to give it more memory like RAM to work with. So uh, for Windows 8.1, I'm just going to give it 3 gigs of RAM. Now keep in mind, if you have 8 gigs of RAM, don't give it more than 4 gigs, those are going to be experiencing memory swapping, all right? So uh, once you select the amount of, your, the amount of RAM, um, you're good to go, all right? So uh, now that we've created that up, we're just going to click power on this virtual machine, and uh, we'll go ahead and install Windows 8.1. So uh, once that powers on, you'll see here that it will be loading the installation for Windows 8.1. So we'll just let that load up. Alright, so now you can see here after you do that, the virtual machine is automatically going to start installing Windows for you. So, uh... 
at this point of time um, uh, we'll just leave it and uh, when Windows is installed we'll uh, show you it when it's ready alright So that's the OS installed now. Um, that took about 30 minutes to do. And uh, now we can go on to our desktop here. And uh, that is how you install uh, a virtual machine on uh, your computer. So uh, if you enjoy my videos, please remember to hit the comment button. And uh, I mean, please remember to, to subscribe and like my video. And uh, thanks for watching.